three on one. Wrist shot. Save. Shoot. Blocked. He takes it through center ice. And hit the post with the to Couturier. scoring area, a wrist shot is a great choice. And so good air time on this pass, flat when it lands and the shooter has a walk-in. Winnipeg's been able to break the scoreless top. Gets in, what do we do? Outstanding save with a glove. Long lead pass to D'Amigo. The organist will not. Winnipeg's got the only goal in this one thus far. And with to make a good first impression, see if they do. Toward the net. Rather beat a hitter on this one. Shot, great glove save. For over a century, hockey has been three periods. Not Always interesting to look at the shots on goal, and they are interesting. A shot, blockered away. something right into the scurrier score he's got his second of the game the goaltender had no chance stopping that puck with the quick release Crawford's not able to get the blocker up quick enough to deny this it's a really good shot but you think he'd be able to stop it Under eight. Got it on his stick in the slot. Back in front. Why? Wonderful. All right, he's going to the bench. Roll the dice. Score! From out top, the goaltender had no chance on that slap shot. A bad read by the defensive player, Eddie, helps the shooter out on this play. Once he gets beaten, there's no one between him and the goaltender, and the goalie just can't do anything about it. Chicago's deficit is only one because it on the wing. Try missed. Mister, he missed the net. Versteeg got this one between the blue line. The clock is at zeros, the game is over. The Jets record the victory in this one. Turned out to be a closer game than I would have guessed. They had the puck all night long. They really have lots of energy. They played a physical game. Come away with the victory. Jai's play ended only by a final horn. Good night from all of us. Shifley. Propelled to Giroux. Acrobat to the shadow of the boards by Kane. Great job. Score! They have struck early in this one. Kane's quick flick of the wrist put this puck in from the high slot. The goalie's in perfect position here, just not perfect enough. This is a really accurate shot.
Blackhawks now have a one goal lead. Pass up the middle to McKinnon. That's what those pads are for. But oh, he got The Hawks win it. Ranks one. And that one's just one more save. The puck is scooped up by Couturier. And that's one. First period has been played. It's a one nothing game. The shots on goal are those that are goals, plus the ones that would have been had they not been stopped by the goaltender. And here's our tally. Nine for Chicago and six for the Jets. Kane's goal came early in that period and nothing happened on the score sheet after. We are at intermission time. Took it up the boards and holds. Score! And this one is tied! Giroux's ability to be able to follow that puck to the stick and redirect it and score. The deflection, Edzo, is just too much for the goaltender to handle. He's got a good look at the puck, but when it's tipped, he's fooled. Winnipeg's got this game even up now, and we're safe. Two periods down, and nine for Winnipeg. Pointed to Daly. Wrist shot, got his. That one is knife down. Nice job holding the puck. And a save. Full steam up the wing. Two guys together with force. Big force. A Giroux. <laughs> a magnificent pass. Led on to Daly. Score! A power play goal. I gotta tell you, Doc, any chance I had a chance to go to the backhand, I did. And so sometimes your best isn't enough. That is a perfect shot up over the glove hand. The goaltender just was not able to get to it. Right up the middle. Out in front. He missed the net. Brilliant save. Hammers one. That puts his team up by a pair. Oh, that shot was heavy and dangerous. Good thing it didn't hit anybody. Now the goalie's in good position, Eddie, but you shoot it like that, you're not going to stop it. The game is over. The Hawks with a victory here. It's decisive, and not just in goals. They found a way to dominate the face-off circle. Puck possession, you win that. A lot of times, you win the game. moves along with even more promising matchups in the future. Don't miss those. For Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying so long for now.